In the ever-evolving landscape of naval warfare, the Port Avion de Nouvelle Generation PANG, or the Next Generation Aircraft Carrier emerges as a symbol of technological prowess and strategic dominance. In this video, we will delve into the fascinating world of PANG, exploring its innovative design, advanced capabilities, and the transformative impact it promises to have on future naval operations. Join us as we uncover the key features and potential of the PANG, shaping the way for the next generation of naval power. French President Emmanuel Macron has decided to put words into action by installing a nuclear-powered aircraft carrier as the future symbol of French strategic independence, replacing the current Charles de Gaulle. During his speech at the French nuclear industrial corporation Framatome, Macron said that the Le Crusoe plant would produce several major parts of the future aircraft carrier's nuclear reactor and showed a conceptual design at the Euronaval 2022. By doing so, Macron confirms France's desire to maintain its strategic independence. Port Avion de Nouvelle Generation PANG, is a French term that translates to Next Generation Aircraft Carriers. These carriers are the latest addition to the French Navy's fleet and are designed to replace the existing Charles de Gaulle-class aircraft carriers. The PANG is a significant upgrade from its predecessor, with advanced technology and capabilities that make it a formidable force on the high seas. The PANG is being developed by the French shipbuilding company Naval Group, in collaboration with the French Navy. The project was initiated in 2015, and the first carrier is expected to be operational by 2038. The PANG is designed to be a multi-purpose carrier that can perform a wide range of missions, including air defense, anti-submarine warfare, and power projection. The aircraft carrier is expected to be 300 meters long and 30 meters wide. His ship will be able to reach a full speed of approximately 27 knots and will have a crew of 2,000 people. One of the most significant upgrades in the PANG is its propulsion system. The carrier will be powered by two K-22 nuclear reactors, which will provide a significant increase in power and endurance compared to the Charles de Gaulle. The PANG will be able to operate for up to 50 years without refueling, making it a highly efficient and cost-effective platform. The PANG will also feature an advanced combat system that includes a new generation of radars, electronic warfare systems, and communication systems. The carrier will be equipped with the latest weapon systems, including surface-to-air missiles, anti-ship missiles, and torpedoes. The PANG will also have a large flight deck that can accommodate a variety of aircraft, including fighter jets, helicopters, and unmanned aerial vehicles UAVs. French ship will have three electromagnetic launchers of the emails type and AAG airborne finishers, similar to the latest US aircraft carrier, Gerald R. Ford. However, the Port Avion Nouvelle generation will be smaller than the American ship. While Gerald Ford's total displacement is 100,000 tons, the French aircraft carrier will have 75,000 tons, which is still almost twice as much as the current Charles de Gaulle. Since the aircraft carrier is designed to carry aircraft, the basis of the aviation group will be new generation fighters developed under the Future Combat Air System program. The model presented at Le Bourget 2019 shows that these manned vehicles are large and can carry a variety of weapons, as well as operational unmanned wings. All in all, the new promising ship can accommodate up to 32 new generation fighters. The PANG will be a significant asset for the French Navy, providing it with a powerful and versatile platform that can operate in a wide range of environments. The carrier will be able to project power across the globe, providing France with a strategic advantage in the event of a conflict. The PANG will also be able to support humanitarian missions, disaster relief efforts, and other non-combat operations. The development of the PANG is a significant investment for France, with an estimated cost of around 5 billion euros. However, the benefits of the carrier are expected to far outweigh the costs. The creation of a new French nuclear-powered aircraft carrier could significantly strengthen France's claim to European leadership. However, it is important not to turn this project into a symbol of excessive spending, as France cannot afford constant delays and unrealistic illusions about the revival of its former greatness. Please share your thoughts in the comments below. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications to stay up to date with new videos. Thanks for watching.